Hello, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. So you get with me in this video. We continue our learning about the text type. Today we have explanation text. Hello everyone, welcome back to Mr. R. Okay, explanation text is a text which explains processes relating to forming of natural, social, scientific, and cultural phenomena. Explanation text is to say why and how of the forming of the phenomena. It is often found in the science, geography, and a history textbook. The purpose of explanation text is to explain how or why something happens. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. The generic structure of explanation text are just only consists of two structure. The first one is general statement, and then the second is sequence of explanation. General statement consists of stating the phenomenon issues which are to be explained. It's similar with descriptive with issue and the exposition, something else. Yeah, but we call that as a general statement and then the second is sequence of explanation yeah sequence of explanation stating a series of steps which explain the phenomena if you have discussed if you have known about the the what is that the procedure tax yeah the explanation tag and procedure tag has much similarities yeah later we will discuss about that the linguistic features of explanation text it using present tense, using abstract noun, using passive voice, using action verbs, and containing explanation of the process. Okay, now let's go to the example. We are going to have text. The title is How Rain Happens. Yeah. Now we are try we are trying to discussing about the explanation tag okay ladies and gentlemen here explanation tags tell about how rain happens yeah tell the process the first paragraph here rain is the primary we call that as the general statement rain is the primary source of fresh water for most areas of the world providing suitable condition for the diverse ecosystem as well as water for hydroelectric power plants and crop irrigation. In the first paragraph, the writer tried to introduce what is rain. Yeah, he described or he explained rain is the prime resource. Yeah, jadi in the first paragraph, pada paragraph pertama, the penulis want to introduce to the reader about the rain, the background. And then after the the writer introduce about rain, he explain about the process of the phenomena of rain. And then the second, he begins to explain. The phenomenon of rain is actually a water circle. The concept of water circle involves the sun heating the earth's surface water and causing the surface water to evaporate. The water vapor rises into the Earth's atmosphere. The water in the atmosphere cools and condenses into liquid droplets. The droplets grow until they are heavy and fall to the Earth as the precipitation which can be in the form of rain or snow. So in the second paragraph, he explained about the process of rain. And then the last, however, not all rain reaches the surface. Some evaporates while falling through dry air. This is called virga, a phenomenon which is often seen in hot, dry, desert, desert regions. Yeah. Okay. Okay. This is the example of explanation tag. It means that in explanation tag, uh, we deal with how to explain and why. The process is happen, yeah. Okay, the links to feature. It use present tense, action verbs, yeah, passive voice, abstract noun, passive voice like this. Uh, where's the passive voice? This is called, yeah. This is called is passive voice. 
which is often seen is passive voice too. Abstract noun, the phenomenon. Phenomena is abstract noun. Phenomena, you can. Can you touch the phenomena? <laughs> and then the droplets, and then diverse ecosystem. Can you touch the diverse ecosystem? It is called by abstract noun, yeah? Okay, this is the example of explanation text. I hope you understand about that. And homework for you, please create a simple explanation text in three paragraph. Topic title is up to you. Okay, thank you so much for your attention. See you on the next video.